boys, today, the return of not only myself, that's right, I'm finally back, but also the return of FNAF AR Special Delivery. After nearly three full weeks of complete silence from Illumix, ceasing the development of all in-game content to exclusively work on their new gameplay update for the game. It has finally been released. It's, it's again, it's been three weeks. This is probably the longest we've gone without hearing anything from Illumix themselves. Now, of course, they did have to drop it right on a Tuesday at like, what? 2.30. But I'm not complaining, I'm actually really happy because it seems like this update, I'm looking at the list of new additions in the update, and oh boy, is it a big one. They posted to the Reddit saying, get excited for the FNAF AR update landing today. We've released our big update, so please grab that when it hits your app store to explore the awesome new features that we've uh, been crafting for y'all. We hope this will be a good kick off to your week, and we wanted to thank everyone for your patience as our team worked hard to pre uh, prepare all the goodies in this update for you. Dive in and experience number one, the introduction of a brand new leveling system to unlock different animatronics. That sounds exciting. Number two, new and improved animatronic encounter mechanics with more strategic gameplay. That is insane. Number three, the introduction of player buffs to plus uh, up your encounters and enable you to plan out your defense. That sounds interesting. And finally, number four, new leaderboards for you to climb and more competitive gameplay. Not entirely sure what that means. I, I'm guessing just more overall leaderboards. I don't know, may maybe like leaderboard for the leveling system. I don't know. As always, much love from our team here at Illumix. We continue to be inspired by this community and all the passion that y'all bring to FNAF AR. So go ahead and play the new update and thoroughly enjoy PS new skins will be swimming your way soon. Not quite sure when that soon is, because last time they said soon, it was it was three weeks, so. So let's not waste any more time. Without further ado, boys, welcome back to FNAF AR. Welcome back to the channel, and let's hop into the brand new gameplay update. Welcome to 14.0. Uh, Don't worry, all your content and purchases are completely safe. That... <laughs> I feel like you shouldn't have to put a warning like that in the update. Version 14 uses XP to unlock game content instead of your streak. Interesting. As an existing player, all the content you previously unlocked is available in the uh, addition to the new content. We are also giving you credit for your current streak by applying an XP bonus. We are starting all players at level 1. Makes sense. So we can do training on the new systems. After training, you will have access- I'm not entirely sure what all this means, but we're just gonna hit play. Ah, yes, I have to sign up for the uh, Eternal Package again, selling my soul to Fazbear Entertainment. I love it. Your first special delivery is roaming in the neighborhood looking for you. <gasps> okay, so it seems like they finally updated the uh, the tutorial. Let's have a look. Oh my god, what the heck is going on? This time your delivery is in the capable hands of Endo. You can tell that by perception how fast they become aware of you. Be quick, okay? Aggression, durability, and attack. Once you've seen higher aggression animatronics, insist on making the delivery. A little upset that they don't have Andy voicing this, but whatever. Uh, you can see you're feeling brave, so let's tap the encounter button. Okay, so I'm, I'm guessing those three plus icons are my buffs. Of course, I don't have any, but here we go. All right, my phone has been picked up, and as you can see, the brand new UI for the attack. Malfunctioning animatronics uh, cause electrical interference, makes sense. So it seems like we have a bar at the bottom, not sure what that means. Like a blue bar. We have, of course, the energy and the batteries in the uh, at the top of the module. The flashlight button is moved down here, okay? And the shock is also still there. It seems like everything has been made a bit smaller because of the UI. Not sure if I'm uh, that big of a fan of that, but whatever. Hello. Got him. Okay. So that red bar that we saw in the teaser was their health. So that is going to make for some very interesting, um, what's going on with the game? Okay. Interesting new encounters. Sorry if I'm talking really fast. There's a lot going on right now and I'm, XP, okay. And I'm trying to like, you know, soak it all in. Oh my gosh. What is this? <laughs> <laughs> that is, oh my god. Okay, yeah, that's terrifying. Awesome. Oh, dude, I killed him. Shield buff 100. Shield protect 30. Attack block 2. Oh my god, I'm getting so much stuff. Okay, so that's probably the buffs. As the internal package subscriber, your special delivery is on its way. Tap the question mark. Okay, here we go again. 
<gasps> it's Fuebi Fayaz by ear. I earned buffs. Yeah, so these are the buffs. Tap the highlighted plus to enter the loaded thing. Buffs give you an advantage. Tap the highlighted buff icon and then the equip button to add it to your layout. Okay, so we have the attack block. Oh my god, there's so many. Jeez, Olympics, you've been busy. So I do have three, so I'm, I'm gonna use them all right now, because why not? Uh, what did I use? I used that. So let's use the shield buff and... No, I want to do one more. Let me do one more. Whatever. All right, Freddy. Was that a new sound when we went into the fight? So far, this update seems very interesting. Not sure exactly how much it's going to change the game, but I am very interested to find out. Hello. He's over this way. Yeah, uh, it seems like it's going to make the, the, uh, the game a lot more strategic, which is actually something I, I can really get behind. Because usually you just hop into a fight, spin around a little bit, and then shock him. Oh, oh no, he's not dead. Oh no, he's not dead. Oh no, he's not dead. Yeah, so that blue bar at the bottom is the uh, the buffer for the shocker, it seemed like. Hello? Okay, no decloak. I like this. This is awesome. I do think it'll make fights uh, last a bit longer, which I'm kind of iffy about because they already do last uh, a couple minutes, which is kind of a long time. Uh, what was it talking about? I don't know. Come on, Freddy. I don't know how long this video is going to be. Because it seems like there's a lot of new content. And I want to check it all out. You can die? Okay, I kind of like the health bar. I kind of like it. That's awesome. I win. A little delayed. A little delayed with the sound effects and the actual, you know, balloons popping up. More XP. Okay, do I level up? That Freddy balloon is actually terrifying. Okay, not level 3 just yet. <gasps> not all animatronics behave the same way. Check my inbox. <gasps> Are they actually bringing back the god dang uh, emails? I sure hope so. Oh, there's plenty going on in my neighborhood. Check out the map. Okay. Uh, special deliver. Get latest shipping info. Huh? Alright, that just restarted the game. I'm guessing it downloaded more stuff. Okay. So it seems like I now have free reign over the, the, uh, the game itself. What's in the shop? All right, these guys are still in the shop. I don't know why. Inbox, uh, it seems to be the same. The map, okay. What's this? All right, devices, and these are buffs? Ooh, what are these? Oh, okay. Bronze, gold, and platinum. Gains 50, okay. Uh, I'm, I'm happy these cost Faz tokens. Alumix, Pogo. Welcome to the workshop, deploy, assemble, yada, yada, yada. I'm guessing it's the same thing. It looks like he's a bit different. He looks a bit different. Did they give him like new thingies, textures, graphics? Like what's, what's going on with you? Oh wait, no, Never mind. <laughs> I think that was just because of the, uh, the message. Yeah, they look the same, okay. Uh, anything new with this? I'm guessing probably not. Nope, they have been adding a lot of new frames. I have been buying them. Yeah, wasting so much money in this game. Okay, so, what's this? Ooh, streak, encounters, wins. Okay, leaderboards. Global XP, how is someone at 200? Okay, so I think we just hop into another fight. Oh wait, why don't I have the, the thingies? What? Whoa. Where's the UI? What? What? What's happening? Did I not, what, what, what is going on? It does seem like you can leave the fight. Oh, hey. Yo, what's up? I defeated you. Not quite sure what the UI thing is though. I did get the XP. So what's going on here? Huh. So I tapped on the question mark and it gave me this. So is it only for the question mark encounters? That's kind of kind of weird, Lumix. I don't know why they would limit that. Oh, I didn't, I wanted to fight them. So yeah, like if I click on the toxic spring trap, I don't get it. Does he have a new animation? I don't remember that being his animation. I don't know. That's, that's weird. Wait, so if I leave, okay, and question mark, give me an animatronic, encounter, 
What? That's kind of weird. Huh? Why would they only do it for the question mark encounters? What? Unless I'm missing something. I don't see why it's exclusive to the question marks. You know? Like, what's going on with that? So I can't use my buffs if I'm going up against other people's animatronics? And the health bar only affects random encount? Oh, hey. I don't know how I feel about that. That's strange. That is very strange. Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I don't know. That's... That's so weird. That's so weird. So... I don't know. I don't know what to say. I just find that weird. The fact that they didn't apply it to all the encounters, you know? Unless I'm missing something, hey. Huh. I don't know, man. That's a little, that's a little weird in my opinion. It is a good update, don't get me wrong. I think I like this update more than the, um, the other gameplay update in like October. I think this will introduce a lot of new, I love the leveling up system. That's something we've wanted for a long, long, long time. I'm not sure what it means by encounter new animatronics. I'm guessing the higher level you are. Where is he? I do love that animation. That animation is, is smooth as hell. I love that. Uh, where is he? Here he is. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm happy about the leveling up system. I think like that's something everybody's wanted for a super long time. So the fact that it's finally in the game is awesome. Um... Not sure what it means by new animatronics, like if I click on a question mark, the higher level up I am, does that mean I get like spring traps and mangles? Actually, mangles not even permanent in the game yet. I'm pretty sure. You know what I mean? And if you're a lower level, you get like Bonnie and Endo and Chica, Freddy, Foxy, I don't know. I'm, I'm definitely gonna have to test out this new update to see what is new. Um, it'll also be interesting what happens with the skins and the lures, all that stuff. I'd, I'll check that out, actually. Because if you get a new skin, right, they say new skins are coming to the game, you get a lure for the skins at the start. So if I use a lure, do I get this new overlay encounter, UI, whatever? Alright, uh, this health bar thing is really... I'm noticing a few flaws with this thing, because this fight's gonna go on for like 8 minutes. Um, so I'm not really a big fan of that, because <laughs> that is just like dragging out the, um, the fight. It would have been fine if they decloaked more often, which I don't know if they do. Hopefully they do. <laughs> because I've chucked him twice and he's not even at half, half health, so yeah. We're gonna see how this goes. Okay. Oh my god. I've shocked him three times. He's not even at- Oh, oh my god. Uh, it does seem like they decloak more often, but still, man. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Hopefully, the more I play this game, I'm not like, oh, I don't really like this update a whole lot. Because it does seem like it's good. It's just, man, that health bar thing's kind of, you know... Eh. Yeah. Now I'm halfway there. Four shocks in, I'm halfway there. And I'm at 50% battery, like what? Dude. If you don't have a lot of, like, flashlight, uh, batteries, you're screwed, because you can't use the flashlight at all. What? Okay, I'm noticing a few flaws. Okay, some flaws inbound. <laughs> Can decluck, man? What's going on? Come on. Come on. There you go. I still got like two or three more shocks to go. Yeah, I don't know. I don't I don't know if I'm feeling this one, boyos and girlos. Oh my gosh. It does so little. It does so little. Oh, uh, there's gotta be a buff that's like more shock power or something. 
And if there isn't, then my god, these fights are gonna go on for like 10 minutes. Now I don't have to pad out my videos when new skins get released, Pog. <laughs> but like, in all seriousness, they... I don't know, man. There should be a buff. If there's not... Like, I don't know what these buffs do. Block 2, I got like shield 100 or something. Please, just one more. He's still over here. Yeah, I'm gonna have to play around a bit with the new update. <laughs> it seems good, it seems good. I'm just, I'm noticing a few holes in the, uh, <laughs> in the, uh, new mechanics and such. Where is he? Ooh, that flashlight button is very small. Oh, I have to click on the buffs. Well, I still don't know what they do, so. I don't... I'm guessing this protects me from dying? I don't know. Oh my god, I still have one more to go. I would say I want to test it, but I just want to be done with the fight, homie. And if this doesn't give me like 8 million XP points, then my god, this is not worth it. I should get a lot of uh, prizes. I can't deactivate this buff. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> I'm new to this whole buff thing. Come on. Come on, bunny. Come on, bunny, bunny, bunny. You have one more shock, man. Homie, just give it to me. I'm begging. Please. Come on. There we go. Finally. Finally. If you don't give me so much prizes... Please, man. Still being delayed. 13 parts. 17 remnant. 20. Dude, I got the same amount of XP doing a fight that lasted maybe like 7 or 8 minutes to a fight with Freddy that lasted 2 shocks. Level 3, though. <laughs> you, you, you have to have a sound effect. That looks so stupid. How he just fades into existence. All right, attack block, shield protect, uh, shield buff, okay. Ooh, shield buff again. Yeah, I, like, I get more stuff out of leveling up than I do in a fight that lasted, like, seven minutes. I don't know. Yeah, it seems like that's the whole update. It's a good update. Don't get me wrong. It's a good update. I'm noticing a few flaws that I'm not the biggest fan of. It seems like a really good update. I think that they've been working on this for a long time. I think it paid off. I think, again... It's a good update. It's a really good update. I'm just... I guess I should play it a bit more before I make some final opinions. But off rip, I think it's great. I'm intrigued to see where they go. Oh wait, I wanted to try a lure out. I'll just try it right now. So I lured a Freddy out over here. I'm not going to record the screen. Uh, but it does give you the new UI. So that's good. So it seems like... What the... I got some XP. I must have clicked on a, a balloon or something. <gasps> it saved my recording. Thank God. Hopefully I get a better grasp uh, on the update when more content gets released, like the skins. I don't know when they're getting released. Hopefully, by the way, we get a new character. I know I don't want to be the guy that's like, you know, in the video for a huge freaking new gameplay update. That's like, oh, Lumix, who is the new characters? But like, it's been a long time. It was, it's been a long time. It's nearly been half a year, homie. But yeah, honestly, I'm a huge fan of the update. I just gotta get a better handle on it before I make any final opinions. But it does seem good. I just gotta get used to it. I'm I'm not sure if I'm a huge fan of the, uh, the health bar. Hopefully, that Bonnie fight was just like a super difficult one and they're not all like that. Uh, like that. But um, like imagine fighting Springtrap and Balor and Mango. I, whatever, whatever. I think my favorite thing about Illumix and what they do with FNAF Hero is how on the outside, you know, on the surface level, it seems like what they're doing is people pog. But then you actually look into it and you're like, maybe this isn't so people pog anymore. And you know it's ridiculous when I haven't even gotten the chance to edit my video, edit the main footage I recorded maybe less than 30 minutes ago, uh, and there's already a lot of, um, backlash about the update. So I'm throwing this on here at the end because I think everybody should be made aware about what is going on, why are people saying the things that they're saying about the new update, and so yeah, let's talk about that. I'm gonna make this quick because I have already kind of talked about my uh, thoughts on the update in the actual video, so I'll quickly reiterate them. I think overall the update is pretty solid. I definitely do see the idea that they were going for, and I think it is 100% there. I think the execution is kind of hit or miss. Uh, when I was playing the game, I had no problem. 
but apparently the the new UI, you know, with the the module and the um the buffs, apparently that only works with the classic animatronics, Freddy Bonnie, Chica Foxy, and Endo. I don't know if that is the exact list of all the characters that can use that feature, uh, but as you did see, when I used my lure, I used it on Freddy, and it worked then. But apparently, it only works with the, uh, only select few animatronics, which I think is complete bogus. And also the buffs themselves. I think they are a great addition. Same thing with the leveling up system. Though apparently when you leave a match, you know, mid-match, you still get the XP, which is a little sussy. I'm sure that's a small bug that will be fixed very soon, so I'm not gonna harp on that too much. But the buffs. Again, I think they're great. Um, but if you saw in my video, I, there was a, uh, a little sub-menu. There's a sub-menu on the map where you can buy the buffs, and when I first saw it, I only saw, like, you know, the fast token price tag, and I saw that it was like, oh, you can just buy these buffs, and I was like, oh, that's actually, you know, super helpful, and, you know, I like how it's fast coins. But apparently, I should have read what the actual text said, because apparently, <laughs> It's not a good thing. So, for example, the Platinum buff package, by the way, thanks to Stu and Smear, who are just the fantastic people on Twitter for bringing this to my attention. Apparently, the Platinum buff package, quote, contains 50 power-ups, and you're guaranteed at least 20 epic and 10 rare power-ups, buffs. But if you do the math, 20 rares, 10 epics, or whatever it was, that's only 30. That's not quite 50. And so now you're like, wait a second, these are kind of like loot boxes. And at first you're like, oh, that's not too bad. A lot of games have loot boxes. At least they're Faz tokens. You gotta keep in mind that this is a Lumix. And for some reason, they just keep adding ways to not, I don't want to say steal your money, but definitely add in methods that are very questionable. And the addition of loot boxes, like what the f is even this? Again, it's crazy how on the surface level everything seems fine, but then you actually take a second and you look into what the update adds, and at, you know, it's like, I don't know, man. The update's good. I definitely think the idea is there, but just the way Illumix, oh my gosh, why? Like, only the classic animatronics have the new UI. Freaking loot boxes in the game. Apparently, there's a lot of bugs and glitches. I haven't encountered any, so I'm just taking that. I don't know, man. I hope they come back to it because I do think it can be a very solid update, but knowing Illumix, they're gonna move on. They're gonna keep doing their skins. Again, I think the update's pretty solid. It's just when you actually look at what they're giving you, it's it's definitely questionable at best. It's just like, uh, Illumix, why are you the way you are? Why do you do the things you have to do? But yeah, that's the update. I've already done the outro, so... I'm gonna leave, alright, say goodbye to editing Johnny Blocks, bye. And I'm excited to be back playing FNAF Hero, and I'm excited to be back posting videos, I know I was gone for like a week, what the heck. But yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you all on the flip side. Goodbye.